y'all. Welcome back. Uh, we're out here at Tail of the Dragon Sunday morning, bright and early. Like I said this is the last little uh, bit of riding before uh, I gotta head home. So uh, I haven't really had the camera on all weekend. We've been, mostly been doing fun family stuff, hanging out, having a good time. Did a little bit of riding, did Gatlinburg yesterday. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll have a nice fun trip back home this morning and uh, later this afternoon. But because it turned into more of a family vacation than uh, a riding vacation, I'm uh. I didn't get to do a lot of the like the hard like fast pace absolute balls to the wall hammering right to right that I like to do. Like like that right there. I get to hammer through this little section. It's like I still gotta like kind of warm up my brakes before I absolutely send it. And uh, these ones, like like I said, that first initial like hard hit, you gotta get a little bit of heat into these ones before you'll be able to park it and then rotate in. So uh, yeah, that's just kind of what it is. like pivot and rotate plant and go They've been on the bike for two or three years and uh, showing some wear. Like I said, I think uh, I'm going to probably switch out to like Brembo. Brembo with some ASVs would be my personal preference. Um, I may swap to the Behringer setup. There, at least for the Master, I got to check. Make sure the piston bore and stroke are right. Or at least make sure they're set up to what I think I want. Uh, I'm running the Stockmaster right now. Which isn't awful, but like it leaves a bit to be desired. got a little bit of mushiness like that first initial take up and uh, I'm not really a fan of that like I 
guys. Uh, you can see I get a little head shake coming off a of hard, uh, going into hard decel. So, like I said, I want to add a little stabilizer, maybe finesse the neck bearing settings on that a little bit. section through here is just like nice I'm not pushing through here not hard I'm not trying to heat soak the bike before I get to the get to the actual spot. Just oh yeah, there we go. That thing stops. Like I said, I could break right there and almost stop it. Go. Brakes are super, super nice. I probably should have gotten some better back brake pads, but Like I said, uh, it probably wouldn't have hurt. I probably need to get a new rotor for the back now that I'm thinking about it. back there's a Porsche I'm gonna suit up and get ready to give it a good rip and to kind of book it
dialed in so I can see the next couple of turns coming up. scouting trip to see what we got to work with. I never run fast downhill. I always come uphill with the speed if I can help it.
I, I have trouble getting in first gear sometimes. Especially coming in straight away and slamming into first. We may just try to run this whole thing in second. I can tell. Now later on the on the bass back, I feel like uh, we'll do pretty good. This is a this one's kind of blown anyway. That car at the start put us behind the eight ball, so the trick's just to be clean and run good lines. Figure out what's working this time.
some of these I may actually need to be in first gear for to keep the RPM. brake lever a little farther back. It's just a little too far out. good. Well, there's the view. Pretty awesome. Take a break and then uh, we'll run it back the other way. <laughs> 